another year older since the last time I talked to you. That's how long it's been. All right, it's been a few days, but I had a birthday. So hi, how are you? Super excited to talk to you about all of the pieces that I have to talk to you today. So today we're gonna talk about the Abigail and the Addy, both corduroy. They are meant to be worn together. You can absolutely wear them apart, um, but we're gonna talk about all of the things. I'm not wearing the Addy currently. Addy is a skirt. Um, I'm gonna put that on midway. Currently I am wearing our new flared denim and I am in love, but that is not what this video is about. Okay. Um, if you're wondering about them, same great fit. They have um, a little high rise like the kick flare. Um, the top is just like the kick flare, but they are a 31 inch inseam. And um, from you, I know you can't see them, but they are plenty long enough for my little 5'4 body. Um, and I am obsessed. But that is not this video. That's later. But I know somebody would be like, wait, what? So I told you. Now we want to talk about the Abigail. Look at the Abigail, you guys. So if you have been around for a while, you've heard of the Abigail. Maybe you're like, wait a minute. Why does that sound familiar? Sounds familiar because we've seen the Abigail before um, in our great outdoors collection almost two years ago now um, it was our flannel you guys remember our flannel right it's got the side seam pockets um, there was solids and there was plaids and it was a button-up and it was a flannel material like a heavyweight flannel material this Abigail has gotten herself a little uh, rework she's gotten herself a little makeover and re-released as this Abigail this is a mainline corduroy Abigail now I'm actually sized down multiple okay so if it looks a little bit snug that's why um, we did this again recently as well where I, I think with the Caitlin sweater where I started at the bottom and worked my way up because I can wear multiple sizes so rather than starting right in the middle which is where I actually am and then going down and then going up and all of those things I decided we're just gonna we're gonna go we're gonna go in order because I can wear the small um now you can see there is a little bit maybe it, you can almost tell that it's it's not it's not tight tight but it kind of pulls a little bit here and there so this one is a small I am a large um I like the large but I was like oh wow so if you tried Abigail before they're similar yet different okay similar yet different because these this corduroy is so soft so soft so way softer than those other abigails and this one has some stretch to it look at that so those other ones the 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 uh, great outdoors collection the flannel ones they didn't really have a lot of stretch um so for me personally i have mediums and larges in those in my closet um and i really have to wear the large if i want to button it up all the way because of the girls which we talk about all the time so you understand um if you're new to me hello my name is katie i didn't even introduce myself i'm pretty sure also this is caption crash with katie we're a little over ticket today we're talking about abigail and addy and um I have big boobs. So there you go. Now you're caught up, but I am a 30 AG. So, um, I could not button that up. I did wear my mediums and I would button up, you know, about this far, um, and leave them open. Or once I did button up a little bit higher, I wore like a bralette thing that had little strappies. That was kind of cute, but they were pretty tight across here. So I had to go with the large. The large was a little bit big all the way around. Um, these fit so much better. I was just like, look, I can close it all the way if I wanted to snap this last one I could. Um, those last two actually, if I, you know, I can wear it all the way and it totally works. And this is a small, again, I get feel a little bit of not a small, it's fine. Um, I just came off a weekend of my birthday and probably a little bit like I was doing a little bit better, but then I had a birthday and it went, Bruh. so, um, side seam pockets. We've got the collar. I mentioned she got a little and makeover and upgrade. So now we have snaps rather than buttons. So I actually love that makes it so much easier. Cause if you've ever watched me try and function with buttons, it's not a good time. I can't do it. Um, so here she is. Look at even in the small, um, even in the small, it still closes nicely. It doesn't feel like it's super, you know, sometimes the smalls on me, they sit way out here because of the girls, because of the tummy, because of all those things. This still sits pretty nicely here on the inside. We also had a bit of like flappiness right here in this, um, in the last one and that pocket was loose. Now you can see there's a little, um, there's a little tie there, keeps this part kind of closed, keeps your pocket from getting all flappy around. Uh, so that's that part's nice. And this fits really nicely. They're super, super soft. Uh, again, they have got really great stretch and they come in gorgeous solids. Now, I also mentioned we're gonna be talking about the Addy today, which is also a corduroy skirt and they were actually designed to be worn together. So I'm gonna, um, 
pause. I'm going to change. I'm going to change out of the pants. I'm going to put on the skirt so that we can see what they look like together. Again, not required. I would 100% wear this all the time without the skirt, but I also really wanted to see them together. So a lot of the Addie colors and the Abigail colors match. We will have exact matches in some of the colors. There are two extra colors in the, um, the Abigail. So this is one of them. This cream color, I believe, does not come in the skirt. And then there is a wine that doesn't come in the skirt. But the rest of the colors we're going to see today um, all come in the skirt and in the top so that you can you can mix and match or you can do match on match. You could definitely wear this. It's a shacket, meaning it is a shirt jacket. So you can button it up and wear it completely as a shirt or you can wear it as a jacket and overlay however, wherever your style takes you, right? So the next thing I want to try for you is the skirt. Um, I'm only going to show you one size in the skirt today um, and I'm going to coordinate her with the matching Abigail. So it's going to be exciting. I'm very excited. I don't know if the colors I'm choosing are going to go great with my shirt here, but we're going to do it anyway. So let's, let's do it. All right. Are you ready for that fall look though? Are you ready? It's actually so stinking cute. I can't even with it. So um, first of all, one thing that I s forgot to mention with the, when I was talking about the Abigail a minute ago, is that it does have the snap cuffs as well. So if you wanted to keep it on, see, aren't you so glad there's snaps and not buttons? Because I'd be here for like 20 minutes trying to um, button these. I can barely snap them because I have like no fine motor skills. <laughs> um, so if you wanted to keep undo the cuffs so that you can roll them or whatever, which is like super cute, I'm liking that look a lot, um, then you can absolutely do that. Again, we have those pockets. You can see this one is a medium. It's a little bit, it's a lot more flowy. I can snap this one up just fine. I mean, you saw, I made sure to start with the small snapped up so you could see there's plenty of snapping space there. So this is absolutely a look. You can mix and match with the different Addy colors to more more coordinating colors, or you can do a full on match with um, the Addy. So that's what I wanted to try. So I had the orange Addy, so I wanted to do the orange Abigail. So now let's talk a little bit about the Addy. So we've got patch pockets here on the front. Again, this is the same corduroy material. It's very, very soft. It has really good stretch. Look at that. That's plenty of room there. I am only showing you a large today, which is my true size. Um, but I do feel like I probably could have sized down one if I wanted. Now, if I size down, you can see it's hitting me right about at the knee there. I'm five, four. I'm not exceptionally, um, tall. And I would say I'm probably fairly proportionate between, um, like torso to leg, but compared to like some, my legs are a little bit longer. I don't think I've never looked at myself and thought that like, Oh, I have a short torso or Oh, I have long legs or Oh, I have long or short legs, long torso, any of that. So I feel like I'm probably pretty proportionate there. Right. Um, but my legs are longer than say like my mom's who's an inch taller than me. So I do have some leg and it hits me right above the knee. So it would be shorter if I were to, um, size down one, but there's enough stretch in here that I really think I could. I, however, I'm actually going to take this off for a second just so that we can really see, um, the Addy. I, however, feel like this large is really nice. That's really my true size. It's what I wear in most bottoms. I can wear small or can size down to medium and some, but this is just nice. It's very, very comfortable. I love there's no like defined waistband here, right? Um, I mean, you can see it more in the back with that elastic there, but the front right about here, you can see where that elastic waistband starts in the front here. Look, at it looks like you almost folded the waistband under the, the, the pocket starts right there. And if you can see, this is a patch pocket it goes right there and right there. So basically it's slapping a piece of fabric on top of the skirt to give it that pocket. That's what, like what a patch pocket would be. Um, and then the button and the, then the skirt and the pocket starts right there at the top. And these are faux buttons. There's no, there's not even a flap. You can't even like open it. It's just looks like it. And then it's got those buttons on there as well. This is nice and flowy. I also feel not super flowy, but I mean, nice and flowy enough. I'm not wearing any type of shapewear. I'm not even wearing shorts underneath. You guys know I always wear shorts underneath like dresses, skirts, whatever. It's a thing, chub rub, all of that. Um, thick thigh life. Um, but this time I'm nothing because I was wearing the denim and I did not plan ahead. Okay. So I don't have any kind of shapewear to control this area that 
we all know and hate, okay, on me. We all hate this on me. Yeah, no, you know what I mean. We all hate this, this little area. A lot of us do. Um, and I'm not wearing any shapewear and I feel like this is fine. Uh, I mean, a friend of mine was like, I feel it's, she's like, it's not going to look good on anyone with a fupa for sure. And I'm like, I have got a big one and I think this looks great. So proved her wrong. I'm going to have to write her after this. Um, so this looks really nice. If I were to size down to a medium, it would get tighter. It would definitely hug a little more in this area that we do not like. So this large is just perfect. And I feel like if I was just wearing something with just the teeniest bit of compression, um, just anything that I would typically wear underneath my skirts normally, um, then this is fine. Only on occasion, certain movements that I make, do I really notice it. And I feel like the, I'm the one noticing it. Maybe you are too, because I am literally going like this. <laughs> Look at it. Um, but I think in the day to day, if I was walking around, this is not something I'm not gonna be walking down the street and somebody's gonna be like, Oh my God, would you look? And no, because it's just that perfect amount. It doesn't show at all. And I love, I just, I love that. I actually am way, um, more excited about the skirt than I thought I was going to be. So that's pretty exciting. And this look, um, it's fall. It is October friends. I am an October baby. I love me some October and I feel like this right here is October. Maybe I changed my shirt. Maybe I don't. I don't even hate it. I am in fall right now. So happy. I need me some, some nice fall boots on instead of my bare feet that I'm actually currently wearing. Um, and I love. So this was a medium Abigail. You saw the fit was nice. It was more flowy. I could definitely snap it up again. I could wear a medium and a large previously in the Abigail. It's just that that material just had no stretch. Um, and I could not button it over the girls. This one almost feels like it does run a tad bigger. So I could, um, definitely, even if it didn't have stretch, like it still felt like I would be able to button it up just because it feels like it just, it's just made a little bit. They just kind of changed the make a little bit. Um, but it's pretty much what you expect. It's got the great collar. It's got those side pockets, um, that you love for all of your things. And then we have great colors. So not necessarily the super most fashion forward. Maybe this is very fashion forward. I don't know. The orange and the green um, look good together, but then you throw in the red. We got a lot of color block situations going on here. I'm trying to decide right now if I love the hell out of what I just did or if I'm like, Katie, stop it. <laughs> stop. What are you doing? Nobody's going to take you seriously right now. I can't decide. You guys tell me. By the way, let me know what you're thinking of these in the comments below. Um, but... This one now is a large. So this was going to be my true size. This is also going to be the intended fit. Now, a lot of things like we always talk about, you can size down and you can size up in things a lot of times. Um, it's just because you can doesn't mean you should, or sometimes it does mean you should, but it is kind of more, this is the intended fit. So this is how the piece was intended to fit a person. Um, it's not that it runs exceptionally big. It was, it was made to just be a little bit more on the flowy side. It's a jacket. So wear it as a jacket, wear it as a shirt. What I have going on down there. Um, and there you go. So this is the large. I've got that room there. It is I mean, there's still plenty of room. I feel like I like twisted this when I snapped it. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Have you like snap it and then you like kind of move it? That's what I did. So it made it look weird, but now it's lying flat. Um, so there is space down there. It's a little bit, so there's not, it's not too snug around the hips, not too snug around the bum, the boobs, even there's still plenty of room up there. Plenty plenty of room. So this would be, if I were to wear the large, totally buttoned up. It's still super cute. You could wear it on its own. You can layer it. You can do all of those things. So this is my true size. Definitely going to go with my true size. I do really like the medium. And like I said, I liked the mediums before. If I could just get them too close over this problem. Um, and that is not a problem here. So I do really, really like the medium as well. Um, that said, those are all of, oh, let's just throw that on the floor, shall we? Yep, we're going to throw it on the floor. I can't, I can't get it back. Cannot be saved. Cannot be saved. So that being said, the last one I want to just throw on an extra large for you, which is going to be a size up just so that we can see it. I feel like this would be definitely fine too, especially if you're wearing it jacket style, jacket style rather than shirt. So a jacket, a shirt jacket. Do you feel me? Just in case you've never heard the term. Uh, 
these not being snapped right now is driving me crazy but there we go look at if it was buttons we'd still be here from the last one i tried to buy i tried to close um so this one is the extra large so it's a little bit bigger i don't feel like any of them look exceptionally bigger or smaller when i put them on but there are things that I notice when I'm standing here, staring here, talking to you. I'm like, it doesn't seem that much different than the large. It doesn't seem that much different than the medium. But if I were to switch from medium to extra large, you'd see it. Does that make sense? Is that how it looks to you? Does it look very similar? Or are you like, no, that looks way bigger. I don't know. You tell me. You let me know. Comments. That's what they're there for. Um, so this one, extra large, definitely could still do this as well. We have plenty of room here. Obviously, with plenty of room in the large, plenty of room here in the extra large. The fact that it's got that stretch, it's so comfortable. I loved the last Abigail, and I'm loving this one like moons more than the last one. It especially helps with the pockets. Those pockets are a side seam pocket. So they're back a little bit far um, because they sit right there at the side seam of this, which I realize is maybe a little difficult for you to see in a black one. But you can see that side seam there, just like it comes down straight from the pit. And then there is your pocket, those hidden side seam pockets. Really, really nice. Uh, really just, just so they're just so soft. I'm just really, really impressed by the feel of these. And they're just so soft and super, super comfy. This is definitely going to be something I'm going to want to grab a lot in this, this fall. Right now, I was going to say uh, come fall, but it's already fall. It's just, I live in California. It doesn't feel like fall today. So you just never know. But these are fantastic. The Addy is also fantastic. That would definitely be a true size. If you want it to be a little bit more fitted, you could probably size down one. I only have the large to show you today. Um, when it comes to bottoms, there's just not a lot of things to show. So I was like, we're going to go with the large. It's going to be good. I mean, I could show you, um, if I showed you a medium and extra large is going to fall down, you just, it's your true size. You know what your size is on the bottom, whatever you typically go for, that's the size you're going to go with there and I have plenty of room um, but that great stretch there between the stretch that the um, just the material has and the stretch of that waistband in the back I love because if you get too tight just because you can't size down and then that starts digging into you a little bit gives you a little like love handles and stuff as that elastic like digs in this is not going to do that um, this it's super nice I'm really really enjoying these these pieces so i hope that you will really really enjoy these pieces um make sure like comment share subscribe do all of those things i know other people say share and never tell you to share you could absolutely share with your lula loving friends or maybe just your fashion loving friends anybody let them know i'm here also if you are not already a member of my fashion community over on facebook i would love it if you join us fyi in case i've never mentioned it because i don't feel like i have i also have a shopping site you can shop directly on depending on when you're watching this some of you are watching this you're from my group i just went over there i posted it and you guys are waiting for my live that's going to happen tonight but then there's some of you that are going to watch this over the next couple days and maybe even months and you're going to be interested in this style and if it was in the next couple of days it's most likely on my website for you to go and grab right now without ever talking to me if you don't want to but if it's not there or you have questions always feel free to reach out I'm always here to help happy to help um and I hope that you love these pieces I am I'm like I'm blown away you guys I did not order a lot I was like mm, meh I want to try it I don't know especially like the skirt I don't know we'll see and now I'm like I was so wrong should have ordered so much bigger. We're going to have to go back in and place another one because these are fantastic. All right, I'm going to see you guys for the next one. Bye-bye.